boys a bit battered and bruised. Obviously, it was a you know it was a tough, tough test match as, as you'd expect against Australia. Um, but you know, it always smiles when you come out on top. So um, we managed to scrape through for the first time in I think it's ten years. Um, so the boys obviously you know as in attitude and uh, atmosphere is pretty good to be honest. And uh, you know back to back victories in this autumn is the first time for us. So again, I think our boys are very upbeat and looking forward to this week. Biggs is world class and he is, um, you know, we, we're very lucky. I know obviously Lead missed a couple on the weekend, um, it's very unlike him, but you know, we've got world class kickers in our squad with him and obviously Dan and, and Gallus has been exceptional this year for the Blues, so you know, I've got no issues with him stepping up and taking that. Um, I wouldn't have thought he'd even be nervous, Biggs anyway, I think it's bread and butter for him and uh, you know, we expect him to get it and he did. Fanny's okay, he's going to be all right, just see how he goes over the next day or two. And again, I think it's just the culmination of a tough test match, a bit battered and bruised. And, um, you know, these boys go through the, through, through the mill, to be fair to them, when they play. So, uh, but hopefully he'll be fine for this weekend and be in contention. George is the same, you know, I think we'll just see how George goes over the next few days. Um, he had a heavy knock, obviously, uh, in the game. Um, obviously, couldn't play no further part in it. So, again, but again, most of these boys will see how they go throughout the week and uh, they'll go through their um, treatment with Prav and stuff. Yeah, well, it's unbelievable. I do think that's not a penalty. Um, I'm not quite sure what the rules are stated at this moment in time, but um, you know, for half us, he doesn't go down lightly. You know, he's a tough old, tough old player, and uh, he's constantly getting up and keeps playing. And um, but for him to go down and certainly suffer HIA, there's certainly some sort of head contact. Um, but the ref didn't think so on the day. But it is what it is. And look, and we got to get on with it. And uh, but he'll go through his protocols and see where he's at later on in the week. It's unfortunate for Samson. He's um, he's an outstanding rugby player, and um, the last few times he's been in, he's just suffered a few injuries, and and likewise again this time. So obviously it's sad to lose him, but um, it, it is what it is. Patch has been an outstanding player for us, certainly in the summer. He's exceptional. So to have him back into the fray again and available for selection is excellent, and uh, just gives us um, obviously uh, more to select from. We've got a fantastic squad, and uh, the boys are outstanding on Saturday. So, as, as I said, you know, it's, it's a squad environment, and uh, I'd like to think that uh, Gaston Show will give the boys a few, a few opportunities this Saturday, and we'll see how that goes.